members of the uh, board, I am pleased to inform you that we did have, in fact, our first meeting of the commission uh, on January 26th. Our second one is scheduled on the 23rd of this month at Patriotic Hall. At our last meeting, we did have a chance to information on this report that Max just presented. He presented it to the commission itself. And there were some commissioners who had some concerns about the uh, level of violence in the jail system itself, the uh, number of assaults on the deputies, as well as the uptick in the number of assaults overall. So that's something that we're going to be looking at. I would like to let you know that at our next meeting uh, on the 23rd, the subject of the uh, uh, mental health evaluation teams will be the subject of jour at the meeting and a report from the sheriff's department, as well as potentially from one of the, either the mental health department uh, or the Department of Health Services on that very subject. So we're working very closely with uh, the IG, and I want to thank uh, the IG and the board executive offices for all of their help in uh, getting us to this point thus far. Questions for Mr. Williams at this juncture. Juncture. All good? Gentlemen, thank you. Thank you. Thank you, sir. Mr. Chairman, there are four individuals who have signed up to speak on this item. Alrighty. Would the following individuals please come forward? Uh, Arnold Sachs, Eric Previn, Wayne from Encino, and Daryl Cruz. You allocated your time. Please have a seat. I allocated and two minutes for this item. I'm minutes. sorry. I'm, I'm guided by the executive oh, officer, boy. not by you. This is you. a Shonda, we say in my language. Oh, unbelievable. All right. Let me, let me let me tell you how unbelievable it can be. The jails. Unbel now you're let talking me. in the middle of my presentation. No, no, I'm not. I'm going to give you the full minute if you wish to have it. If you don't, you can be excused. Next speaker, please. No, well, I'm step in your office. He doesn't work for you. You just uh, please proceed. Yeah. My time to Arnold. All right. Thank you. Um, discussion about reforms and oversight for the sheriff's department um, never ever includes the fact that the board of supervisors are the people that negotiate with the sheriff's line personnel and the personnel and the sheriff for contracts. ALADS is negotiated through the chief executive officer and the board members. What do you expect all these independent review clauses or committees that you create, what do you expect them to be able to do when you create the contracts. There was a story 